and there's the bell. And here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. Somebody's ego is going to be severely bruised after this submission match, guys. Nobody ever likes to utter the words, I quit. Done. What a stop! Good grief! Jericho struggling a bit, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. I know it's early, but he has to Jeez. do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. Beautiful technique. Going for it all here. Ooh, that'll mess up your shoulder. But is it enough to end it? This is going to be big, one way or another. If you're going up against Chris Jericho, you can't allow him to get an early advantage. Chris is versatile enough and mean enough to maintain it. Make sure that you regret it. Drop down. What's this? Vincent Ogutz oh. Absolutely planted. Earlier, Corey, you talked about Chris Jericho getting an early advantage and keeping it. Anyone who opposes Y2J needs to make sure he doesn't have that opportunity. There's no way an opponent of Chris Jericho's can allow him to take an early advantage. I don't mean just for the match's sake, but for the sake of your career. Jericho can be as ruthless as they come. Y2J is starting to fade. Oh, man. His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling and unceremoniously deposited down. Now that's what I call big move coming. Wait for it. In a submission match, the name of the game is to make your opponent tap out from a submission move. There have been so many submission specialists throughout the history of this great business. Brett Hitman Hart, Kurt Angle, Brock Lesnar, William Regal, and Daniel Bryan are a few who come to mind. And on the women's side, I think about Alundra Blaze, Natalia, Becky Lynch, Charlotte Flair, and the boss, Sasha Be Ooh, Chris, boom, what impact. Come on, Jericho. This might be it. Oh, my. Come on, Jericho. Put that stupid idiot away. Corey, earlier you spoke about a submission match, and one thing I'd like to point out is that a submission match is not necessarily the same as an I quit match. The key difference is that a submission match requires the use of the submission maneuver. In an I quit match, victory can be achieved by bringing your opponent to the point where they quit as a result of the overall punishment they've received in the match. That's an important distinction, Michael, especially since a superstar can win an I quit match by using the submission maneuver. For superstars who aren't proficient in submission moves, they enter this type of match at a disadvantage. It doesn't mean they can't win, but they need to perfect applying a submission move quickly. Come on, Corey, try and keep up. One of the things a superstar who's competing in a submission match has to be careful of is if they have an injury or have been injured in the past and people know about it. You can bet in a submission match that your opponent is going to target that body part immediately. It's like having a giant bullseye on an arm, leg, ankle, or shoulder. Byron. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their back. There it is. It's locked in. The walls. But can he follow up here? Wow, he escapes it. He's just got no... Submission time. This could be it. When we talk about submission matches, we have to speak about one that, in many people's eyes, set the standard. It was WrestleMania 13. Bret the Hitman Hart was in a heated rivalry with a brash star on the rise named Stone Cold Steve Austin. This match started like no other submission match, with the two superstars battling in the crowd and attempting to use ring steps as a weapon. Look, he's stunned here, guys. How do you rebound from this? Oh, damage. 
to the body. Come on, Jericho, put that stupid idiot away. And here's Jericho trying to work some Jedi mind tricks. He wants no part of the outside. Oh no, we know what this is. There it is. That's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. How is Jericho going to remain alive? He'll find a way. Future shot. That has got to be it. Second time? Sure, why not? Looking for the exclamation point. Fighting for survival. Tap, tap, this match is over. 